and welcome to the man games in this video today we are going to be looking at similar tires of the usos from wrestlemania where they lost their undisputed tag team championships if you are and you watch the man games make sure to subscribe to the channel make sure to click that thumbs up button if you do enjoy today's video and drop us a comment and let us know what you thought of the usos losing their tag team championships at wrestlemania so like I said before, this is a similar attire, so we're going to go into Jimmy Uso next. So we'll just click on the entrance attire here. Edit. So we are going to go down to clothing, then we're going to go to head. We're going to go down to caps. So it is this cap here, which is already on the game. It will already be set on the other Uso's cap, which is the bloodline, which is that one there. But we are changing it to this one that is up here like so and it is very very simple all you need to do is you need to change color number one to that shade of red there so you look at the color picker that will give you the correct shade and then we have black for the second color now obviously in their entrance they did have on a neck accessory but unfortunately for me because i have not actually had chance to play showcase mode i have not unlocked it which is a very, very frustrating. I believe you must have to play the John Cena against Roman Reigns match because it is the Paul Heyman wears it in the showcase mode. I have not unlocked that yet, unfortunately, because I've not had a chance to play showcase mode. So hopefully for you guys, if you have, it should be on neck accessories somewhere on here. And obviously you'll, you'll just want to change one of the colors to red and one of the colors to white. But yeah, unfortunately, I cannot do that on my 2K23 yet, which is, yeah, pretty annoying, to be honest. It's not the only annoying thing about trying to create this, actually, which we'll get into in a few minutes. But next up, so we're just going to go all the way back up to the top now, to tops one. So this is the top that is already on the Jimmy Uso on 2K23. And the colours for this top now want to be that shade of white there, so the whitest of white. And, and again for our colour number two. And then we've got this rectangular image here. Now that is covering up the original image already on this top. So it's going over the centre there. And you want the image to be the same shade of white as we've used for the top to blend in like so. And then you want to do the same on the back as well with the second image is covering up the we the ones so it's just covering up the logo on the back there so if we just change color here so you can see where it goes that is covering up that part there so obviously the color wants to be white as well and next up we've got the we the ones right in there going over the center of the t-shirt like so and then we've got the hand up on the back there like so. So how do they get these images? Well, I went onto wweshop.com, took a screenshot of them, and then uploaded them onto WW2K23. If you don't know how to do that, we do have a video showing you how to do that on the channel as well. So next, if we go down to lower arm right, that is already on your gym user, so you don't need to add that on. To fingers left, I've chosen this one here, and the color of that just wants to be changed to white, like so. And then you can copy that over to the right hand and then that will both be exactly the same. Now if we go down to the lower body, so it's the same bombs as already on the Jimmy Uso. So you want the colours to be white, red, white and white. So unfortunately for me, I've tried to add the images onto this Jimmy Uso which were correct as the attire should have. Unfortunately though, say if we we're gonna put on this image here to go between the legs there like he had on at WrestleMania, the image moves and it is no longer there, which is quite irritating to be honest because you can't get it in the right place. So I thought, okay, we can just add the other image down the leg, but when you take an image and take it down the leg, it just disappears as well. As you can see there, don't know why, but yeah, it is very, very irritating. So that is why I could not do this the correct way, which I would like to have done. That's why I've had to settle with it like this. So like I said, this is similar tight, it's not exact, but it's not my fault, it's the game. 
I really, really was looking forward to doing this creation, and yet he can't do it. Well, we, I can't do it to the best of my ability, in my opinion, which is really frustrating. But yeah, this is the best that we can do here at the Man Games, unfortunately. And now if we go down to socks, so you can't actually see them, so you might not want to have this on. But anyway, we've got these socks here, and the colour of those want to be red. But like I say, you can't actually see them, so you might not want to do that. Shoes and boots. Those are the same ones that is already on the game anyway. So that is it for the entrance attire. And then for the in ring, all you want to do is you just want to remove Jimmy's hat. Like so. So that is it for Jimmy Uso. We're going to Jay Uso next. So now into Jay Uso. So entrance attire now. So if we go down to clothing, upper body. So I chose this top here as his was a bit shorter than Jimmy Uso's was. And for this one we need to change the material to cloth, like so. And then the colour wants to be white as well. And then we've got the same images there that we used for the Jimmy Uso, the hand round the back and the wee the ones on the front. And then if we go down to lower arm left, which is this one here, and the colour for this wants to be white, like so. And then lower arm right, we have this one here. And then you want this shade of red there, like so. And then we've got these two images here, they're just going around the wrist part, making it up to look like that. Because obviously you can't have two lower arm right options, so we have just chosen those two images to make it look like this and then for the lower body so the bottoms those are exactly the same as they were for the Jimmy Uso so you don't need to change anything about those and then socks again so that is the same as the Jimmy Uso but they're different socks obviously those ones there they're exactly as they already are in the game and then down to boots and shoes so it's these ones here and the colors for these want to be white white and white and there you have it, that is how to get a similar attire of the Usos on your WWE 2K23. Well, like I said before, I am a little bit disappointed with these creations today that I couldn't get all the images onto them to get them exactly like they were at WrestleMania. It is very disappointing. And not being able to get the neck accessory, I kind of feel like I've let you guys down to be honest. But this is the best I could do. It was a requested video as well. So, yeah, this is the best I could do for you guys. So I hope you did enjoy it. If you did so, please think about Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, make sure to click that thumbs up button, drop us a comment and let us know. And you can also find us on social media at The Man Games on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. We are also on TikTok as well. So thank you very much for watching and supporting The Man Games today and we will see you on the next video.